have a good. Where? For oh, bad guys. We just had lunch at Five Guys because I was really craving a burger. Burgers are good like anytime, you know, burgers are always good. And I ended up paying $14 for my burger and I'm poor. So, you know, whatever. I ended up getting a drink and fries and a burger. So, it's kind of why, but you know, whatever. You got the giant burger with cheese. Really, really bad allergies. Oh god, <clears throat> I can't even talk now. And for like a week, a whole week straight, I've had a really sick voice and like a cough and like stuffy nose and a runny nose and stuff. And it's really getting on my nerves and it won't go away. So I don't really know what to do about that. If you ever get the chance to come to Colonial Williamsburg in the springtime, you should definitely come to the Governor's Palace Garden. You do have to have a pass though. So you should get like a daily pass or something like that because it is worth it. You should always get it. Trust me. Yeah, always get a daily pass if you come to Colonial Williamsburg because there's so many more things that you can do around here. See, isn't this so gorgeous? Look at all those tulips. Oh. I was gonna go down to the canal, right down there, but then it was too cold because there's no sun, so. This is the Peyton Randolph house, which is apparently the most haunted house in at least Virginia. You could say more, but we're just gonna go with Virginia. This one, this does not work as a tripod. Never mind. If I would have thought about it, I would have brought my other lens from my DSLR, but I didn't, so now all I have is my 30 millimeter, and you can't vlog with a 30 millimeter lens, so I have to use this, and I can only use this for the cool scenery shots, because I was stupid. He's just having the best time ever over there. I wish I was him. Being a sheep would be really cool, but actually I'd rather be a cat. Cats live that life. That life. Hi, buddy. How you doing? Is that water good? You're drinking it very slowly. <laughs> very slowly. Please save us. Thank you for not picking the vegetables and helping us protect these heirloom plants from ex- Whoa, for real? Sorry. These are almost extinct? Yep. That is so cool. <laughs> Let's pick them all. I'm just kidding. This is historic cabbage, everybody. This is almost extinct. All of these are almost extinct. I think that that is a pretty cool thing, don't you? I think so. Hi. <laughs> You're so cute. Are you guys hungry? Is that why you're freaking out? Did they promise you food and then they lied to you? That would be unfair. Yeah. You're so anything, pretty. They just decide that like, okay, well now I'm the rooster. What? Yeah. The ma the females do? Yep. <laughs> I know. She's a vast knowledge of chicken behavior. It's amazing. I know. <laughs> Abigail. Yes. Tell me your favorite place to visit in Colonial Williamsburg. Oh. And speak loudly. Um. I like the place behind the book bindery best. I think that area with the stream and the um, the bridge, and apparently it's haunted, according to a guy I met at a tavern once. So. You know that guy that she met at the tavern? Yeah. He told me that he saw a chick there. Bus, you're being very loud and disturbing my interview. Thank you very much. Sitting and reading. My denim on denim ensemble. Is it ensemble? Ensemble? Yes, yeah, that's the word. Currently finishing the fries that were from lunch. 
and they taste not half bad and my flat soda so you know it's actually six o'clock i should be eating dinner but you know whatever let's go see the sunset how is my hair such a mess Ugh. my plan was to come and see the sunset but as you can see the sun has already set so that's great I've never been able to get a time lapse because I've always been so freaking impatient. You have to stand for a really long time and wait till it's totally done or else it does not work. So, Golden Hour is the actual best time in the whole entire universe to film and I wish that I could be filming something better like a lookbook or something but I'm not. I'm just filming the sunset and it didn't work because my camera always says movie recording stops automatically because I don't know what I'm doing apparently and it's literally freezing so I'm gonna go home. There's these two cars that are just stopped to stare at what is no longer a sunset. It's, there's nothing left. Never. Barely. It's still really pretty. It looks so much better on the camera than it actually does in real life. Holy shit.